I gotta go. I'll see you after the ceremony. Hey, wait! Ah, great. Where am I supposed to find another nice, quirky girl to talk to? How's your first day going, little sister? You mean since you ditched me and I exploded? Yikes, meltdown already? No, I literally exploded a hole in front of the school. And there was some fire, and I, I think some ice. Are you being sarcastic? <sighs> I wish. I tripped over some crabby girl's luggage, and then she yelled at me. And then I sneezed, and then I exploded, and then she yelled again. And I felt really, really bad, and I just wanted her to stop yelling at me. You! Oh, God, it's happening again! You're lucky we weren't blown off the side of the cliff. Oh, my God, you really exploded. It was an accident. It was an accident! What's this? The Schnee Dust Company is not responsible for any injuries or damages sustained while operating a Schnee Dust Company product. Although not mandatory, the Schnee family highly encourages their customers to read and familiarize themselves with this easy to follow guide to dust application and practice in the field. Um, you really want to start making things up to me? Absolutely. Read this and don't ever speak to me again. Look, uh, it sounds like you two just got off on the wrong foot. Why don't you start over and try to be friends, okay? Yeah, great idea, sis. <clears throat> Hello, Weiss, I'm Ruby. Wanna hang out? We could go shopping for school supplies. Yeah, and we can paint our nails and try on clothes and talk about cute boys like tall, blonde, and scraggly over there. Hmm? Well, really? No. <clears throat> I'll keep this brief. You have traveled here today in search of knowledge, to hone your craft and acquire new skills. And when you have finished, you plan to dedicate your life to the protection of the people. But I look amongst you, and all I see is wasted energy, in need of purpose, direction. You assume knowledge will free you of this, but your time at this school will prove that knowledge can only carry you so far. It is up to you to take the first step. You will gather in the ballroom tonight. Tomorrow, your initiation begins. Be ready. You are dismissed. He seemed kind of off. It's almost like he wasn't even there. I'm a natural blonde, you know. It's like a big slumber party. I don't think Dad would approve of all the boys, though. I know I do. <laughs> What's that? A letter to the gang back at Signal. I promised to tell them all about Beacon and how things are going. Aw, oh, that's so cute! Shut up! I didn't get to take my friends with me to school. It's weird not knowing anyone here. What about John? He's... nice. There you go! Plus one friend! That's a hundred percent increase! Pretty sure Weiss counts as a negative friend. Back to zero. There's no such thing as negative friends. You just made one friend and one enemy. Look, it's only been one day. Trust me, you've got friends all around you. You just haven't met them yet. That girl. You know her? Not really. She saw what happened this morning, but left before I could say anything. Well, now's your chance. Well, wait, what are you doing? Hello! I believe you two may know each other. Aren't you that girl that exploded? Uh, yeah. My name's Ruby. But you can just call me Crater. Uh, actually, you can just call me Ruby. Okay. What are you doing? I don't know, help me. So, what's your name? Blake. Well, Blake, I'm Yang, Ruby's older sister. I like your bow. Thanks. It goes great with your pajamas. Right. Uh, <laughs> nice night, don't you think? Yes, it's lovely. Almost as lovely as this book that I will continue to read as soon as you leave. Yeah, this girl's a lost cause. What's it about? Huh? Your book. Does it have a name? Well, it's about a man with two souls, each fighting for control over his body. Oh yeah, that's real lovely. I love books. Yang used to read me every night before bed. Stories of heroes and monsters. They're one of the reasons I want to be a huntress. <laughs> Why is that? Hoping you'll live happily ever after? Well, I'm hoping we all will. As a girl, I wanted to be just like those heroes in the books. As someone who fought for what was right and who protected people who couldn't protect themselves. That's 
Very ambitious for a child. Unfortunately, the real world isn't the same as a fairy tale. Well, that's why we're here. To make it better. Oh, I'm so proud of my baby sister. <laughs> Cut it out! <laughs> well, Ruby Yang, it's a what pleasure What the world is going on over here? Don't you realize some of us are trying to sleep? Oh, not you again! Shh, guys, she's right. People are trying to sleep. Oh, now you're on my side. I was always on your side. Yeah, what's your problem with my sister? She's only trying to be nice. She's a hazard to my health. 